Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending where are you watching this video. My name is Yusef Hosseini and I am a hypnotist, helping people to get rid of their weight issues without thinking about diet, sporting or other things. I know there are so many people, there are other people who are also dealing with this problem. But this problem of weight is so big, so enormous, that even though so many people are dealing with it, it needs also other people in order to help the people with weight issue. I know the personal trainers are doing their job, the dietists doing their job, the hypnotists doing their job. And all of these helping people to go and trim out, to get better shape, better body. But everything begins here, inside your head. And nobody can deal better with it than a hypnotist. There are so many hypnotists, so many methods. You can go to the YouTube and listen to the weight loss session. But it's not enough. It is not enough to get you motivated to go and do some training. The personal training trainers do their job perfectly. But before you go and enroll yourself with a personal trainer, you have to change your mind. When you change your mind, you are going to do the right thing. But where, why people cannot change their mind? And this is something that I'm specialized in. I'm going into your mind and your mind is governed with three different things. I don't know if you are aware of having three different brains, your reptile brains, your emotional brain, and your subconscious mind, your, your conscious mind, your neocortex brain. And the job of the hypnotist is just talk to the reptile brain. And the reptile brain is something that governs you, the emotion that create, creates the emotion in your body, so you can act upon it. What is my speciality? I have developed an, a method called emotional healing. And that is exactly what it says, emotional healing, dealing with the emotions. Because the emotions are the, um, the fuel that uses, the people use in order to get motivated to do something that they want to do. Actually, in the beginning, they don't want to do it. But when it is resolved, they act upon it and they do it. Emotional healing is based on different modalities. Modalities which looks at the people, at everything as energy. And the brown of, of energy is the line that's going from top to the bottom. It's the energy band in your system. And then you're out balance because of these emotions. Then you do different things, things that you don't really want to do. And then you get rid of these emotions, then your balance goes back to where it has to be. Then you make a right decision. Because actually, nobody wants to be thick. Nobody wants to be fat. Nobody wants to kill himself by smoking. They are all the different ways of depressing and suppressing the emotions. And when you are dealing with emotions, the only thing you can do is just act upon it. These emotions make, make you really, make, your, your, make you out of balance. And when you are out of balance, you make, you make bad decisions. Some people just say them to themselves, but I like food. 
Now, I like food too. The thin people like food too. But they, you don't, they don't use food in order to suppress their emotions. And that is what many people do without their knowing it. And that is also logical. You see, when we are a child, when we are hang, uh, hungry, what do we want? We want to eat. And the mother gave us just food. And the food comes with warmth in the childhood. And you can imagine that you have other pain. Mother does, you can, as a child, as a child of one year you cannot you cannot say to your mother i i i, when I don't have hunger i just I, I i feel pain but the mother doesn't understand what it does what she does give you put you in, in her, her arms and give you food and that is the moment you associate food with comfort and this is what makes so many people go to food in order to release themselves of the pain because they have always associate the food with comfort and the subconscious mind doesn't differentiate between emotional pain or physical pain when you are in pain what do you do you distract yourself. You are going to uh, search for comfort. And then it is the time you go and you eat. This is the, the time you go and you suppress the emotions, which is going to go up. Emotions are going to come up, but you suppress it with eating. And you don't know what you did that. And that is the main reason people gaining weight there, there is also something else there are some element of protection you see your subconscious mind wants to the subconscious mind wants to protect you and he does it with the with his own way he doesn't know right from wrong he just wants to protect you and how does it do? You see, may, uh, I have many uh, clients with, uh, with weight issue. And some of them having weight in order to protect themselves from their surroundings. Because subconscious mind says, I'm not going to make you attractive to the opposite sex because it is dangerous so what it does it just makes you just go become fat and in order to become fat you have to eat you don't know why you do that but you do it one of my clients said i was just driving and then i don't know why but i found myself just parking at the mall, supermarket, in order to get some food. I didn't need it, but I went there and I bought. I have had, I gathered everything at home in order to make my dinner, but I came home with a bunch of things that I bought to eat because it was that is the conscious mind that tell you lies because it was quicker to do that. And then uh, because the things were out of the uh, fridge, she had to throw it away. So, you know, these things are not logical, but we do it because that is the language of your subconscious mind. This is not logic. It is emotional. The language of emotion is a feeling that you have in your body. And that, this feeling, make you do things that you maybe don't, do not want because you are out of balance. And it is a special way to deal with people with 
weight issues. I'm going to stop this broadcast and I'm going to give this broadcast more often. So if you have any question, please let me know so I can answer to your questions and show you how I help people to get rid of these emotions because these emotions are suppressed emotions and these suppressed emotions are trapped emotions in your body which make you out of balance. Your energy balance is not correct. So this is why you do the things that you are doing, okay? Thank you very much for your attention. I'm going to post this video on my timeline and also I'm going to put a message when I'm going to give the uh, Facebook Live so you can put your questions and uh, I'll be obliged to and glad to uh, answer your question about this matter and uh, comments are welcome and once more time I want to thank you for watching this video. See you in the next video.